this is super glue and anyone in the repair industry knows it to be a very productive tool. The beauty of this is that it adheres on almost all kind of material, wood, sand, plastic, paper, all alike. In fact, it actually also adheres to rubber and leather. This actually sort of reacts by chemical reaction. It's not a physical change like the way you would see the rubber glue that we used in the past. It's basically a cyanoacrylate adhesive and it's a very beautiful piece of device to have. So the scenarios that I've used this is one, building laptop frames, most of those that are broken around the hinges. Two is constructing certain shapes by mixing silica, cement and super glue. It forms a really strong composite that is very structurally sound and it has also helped me fix cracks around items and also to strengthen them and so in case you are wondering always have this in your repairs you know and also be innovative enough and careful when applying it because much as this bonds leather to rubber i really wouldn't use it on my shoe because it burns it stiff and it's very hard to recover it it's not a physical change it's a chemical change neither would i use it on my cloth because every time this has spilled on my cloth it has left a very stiff piece of fabric which when you bend just cracks so i would avoid using it in under under such scenarios however if i am using it on a piece of plastic that has broken or that has a rigid form already and rigidity is appreciated in it then i'll use this don't use this on your smartphone screen repair because this is rigid and you cannot reverse the process in which case we tend to use rubber glue because this you can reverse the process by simply dissolving the rubber glue or applying heat and it will become ductile and the two will separate so super glue is versatile but under certain scenario it's not the best it's just an emergency thing Hit the subscribe button and see you in the next video. Ciao.